update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida, with your 11 a.m. update. And we've got a sea of green out there, at least all the U.S. US indices that we track. They're trading to the upside. Dow's up 64, about two tenths of a cent, three tenths for the S&P or 14 points, four tenths for the Nasdaq, 165 points there, six tenths for the Russell, about a 12 point move, 37 points for the semis. That's eight tenths of a cent to the upside. Gold's up three bucks. Silver's up 25 cents. Slice wheat crude is up 73 pennies. Natural gas up four cents. Thirty-year Treasury down about a half a point, printed out at one sixteen thirteen. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine-panel market update chart. We'll begin with new profile levels that are attempting to form inside the ES Mini. Right now, on the black background charts, I've got support at fifty-two nineteen, resistance at fifty-three nineteen, and above that is its Rhodes Momentum Indicator top pattern. That's at fifty-three thirty-three fifty. So you got right now price trading with inside its profiles. You want to watch that. 52.19 level, but we take a look at it. We really won't know till tomorrow what the actual bottom is. I've got a little bit of a divergence between the white and black background charts. We've got the spot volatility index trading below Friday's low. As long as it remains below that, we're likely to see this rally continue. If we take a look at the NQ, it's also forming a new profile or attempting to. Support down at 18.163, resistance up at 18.555. You should notice on both of these profiles, they have formed above prior profiles. From a profile standpoint, it is still in a bullish trend, both the ES and the NQ. If we take a look at the U.S. dollar index, it's just consolidating with inside its daily profile. It's attempting to form a new weekly profile. That new weekly profile is above the prior weekly profile. Again, it continues its bullish structured um, message based upon profiles. If we take a look at the gold, Goldilocks is going to complete a TD9 count top today. That says whatever today's high is is going to be important to be paying attention to tomorrow and the following days. The high right now is 2372.50. Why is that important? Because the price closes above it, tells you you have a strong upward momentum move. In the case of Goldilocks, its next A to B equals CD price projection level would take us up towards the 2411 area. We take a look at silver. Silver's attained the one to one level at 2823. The actual high is 2820 out there. Now, we can see that prices along that left side of that C to D leg. More likely than not, silver will do more than a one to one A to B equals CD. Its next price projection area will be 2926. You've got uh, light to be crude, also in an A to B equals CD pattern, but it also is traded with inside a profile that has resistance at 87.63 and support at 84.09. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show, if you would, but if you're off to start your Monday, have a magnificent one. Thanks for joining us, and we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.